Thank you guys for all the amazing pictures you have sent me. Here are some of the great artworks you have done. I would like to thank you. I have now almost 2000 subscribers. That's so wonderful, but also so sad because I haven't made a video for a long time. I have been under a lot of stress lately, but now I have decided to make a tutorial and something else. This video is commented by my girlfriend because she is helping me a lot. Hello guys, many people wanted to know how to color pictures with Autodesk sketchbook and how to blend the colors and that's easier than you think. So let's get started. Today we need only four brushes. The technical pen, the inking pen, the smudge flat brush free and hard eraser. We start with the simplest brush, the technical pen. We're gonna draw a simple eyeball today. We need a perfect circle for that. With the predictive stroke tool you can easily draw a perfect circle. With the bar you can adjust the strength level 4 is enough. We paint the lens with the same brush and leave behind a kind of mirroring. That's it! It couldn't be easier. Now we're going to paint the whole thing. To implement this correctly, we have to create two layers. It's also important that the two layers are under the sketch. These are our color layers now. Now we pick one of them and paint on it. Info, the upper layers cover the lower layers, but you can change that at any time. First, we are coloring the iris. For this, we use the inking pen. Then choose a color. It doesn't matter which one. The coloring is very relaxing. So take your time. If you cross the lines, you can fix that with the hard eraser at any time. Now we paint the eyeball with the second layer. Remove impurities with the eraser and you're done. Now we come to the interesting part. Select a layer and lock it. With this little symbol you can lock the layer. We're doing this for a simple reason. If you lock a layer, you can't paint out at the edges anymore. And that's pretty efficient. Now we shade the eyeball. We paint again with the inking pen. Mark the main color of the eyeball. And then paint all brightness levels like this. Progression from light to dark. Imagine a light source. With the smudge flat brush free, you can now blend the colors. Now the circle looks like three dimensional. Perfect. Switch between the inking pen and the smudge flat brush free. Add as many details as you want. It's always the same. My boyfriend uses almost only this tool to coloring something. It is important you don't forget to change the layers while painting. And lock the layers. It will help you. I hope my boyfriend has been able to help you with this video and I hope you enjoyed how I voiced this video. Thank you for your attention.